Have you ever thought about what lies at the heart of our galaxy, the Milky Way? Well, if you haven't, don't worry. You're in for a wild ride today. We're diving straight into one of the most mind-blowing discoveries in recent years involving Sagittarius A, the supermassive black hole anchoring our entire galaxy. And let me tell you, this isn't just any ordinary black hole, it's the kind of cosmic mystery that keeps astronomers up at night. So, why should you care about a black hole that's 27,000 light years away? First off, Sagittarius A, we'll call it SGRA to keep things short, is an absolute monster, weighing in at around 4 million times the mass of our sun. Just let that sink in for a second. This thing is a cosmic heavyweight, and it's been quietly lurking at the core of our galaxy, gobbling up matter for billions of years. But here's the kicker. We might have just found out how this beast was born, and it's way more dramatic than anyone ever thought. Buckle up, because we're talking black hole mergers, violent galaxy collisions, and how this discovery flips what we thought we knew about black holes on its head. All right, so SGRA, as impressive as it already is, might not have always been the lone king of the Milky Way. Recent research from the University of Nevada suggests that it could have formed through a colossal black hole merger. And when I say colossal, I'm talking about a cosmic collision between two massive black holes. Yep, it's exactly as insane as it sounds. Picture two black holes spiraling closer and closer together, pulling in everything around them like some epic space ballet. Except instead of graceful moves, they eventually collide in an explosion of energy so powerful it would make your brain hurt to even try to comprehend it. This theory is a game changer. It's not just about one black hole chilling in the center of the galaxy anymore. It's about a dramatic history that shaped our entire Milky Way. So, how did we even get here? Well, back in 2022, the Event Horizon Telescope, EHT, made history by capturing the first ever direct image of SGRA. And when I say image, I don't mean something you'd hang on your wall. This was more like a blurry orange donut. But in the world of black hole research, that was huge. It confirmed that S. Gray was real, and it allowed scientists to dive deep into studying its quirks. Here's where things start getting really interesting. Two researchers, Yihan Wang and Bing Zhang, noticed something odd about Segur A. It's spin. Yeah, black holes can spin, and Segur A is spinning fast. But there's a twist. Its spin doesn't line up with the Milky Way's overall angular momentum. Basically, it's doing its own thing, and that's weird. Imagine if the Earth suddenly decided to spin in the opposite direction of its orbit. Everyone would be like, uh, what's going on? So, Wang and Zhang dove into simulations to figure out what could cause this strange behavior, and their findings? A black hole merger. Specifically, a collision with another supermassive black hole from a smaller galaxy that the Milky Way probably swallowed up billions of years ago. The simulations show that a 4.1 mass ratio merger, meaning SGRA was about four times bigger than its cosmic partner, could explain its spin and misalignment. And get this, the angle of that merger? Somewhere between 145 and 180 degrees, which in space terms means this was no small bump. It was a full-on galactic car crash. Now, you might be wondering, why does this even matter? Great question. A merger like this doesn't just affect SEGRA, it reshapes the entire galaxy. We're talking about major shifts in the orbits of stars, gas, and dust around the black hole, not to mention the gravitational forces pulling everything in weird directions. And if this happened in our Milky Way, it's likely happening in other galaxies too, meaning this could be a common process across the universe. It also fits into what's known as the hierarchical merger theory, which is a fancy way of saying that supermassive black holes probably grow through a series of chaotic mergers over billions of years. So instead of these giants slowly growing as they suck in matter, it's more like they're forming from multiple violent events, galaxies crashing into each other, merging, and reshaping themselves. Pretty epic, right? And speaking of reshaping, this discovery has major implications for how we model galaxy dynamics. If SGRA grew through a merger, we need to rethink how galaxies evolve over time. It's not just slow, steady growth. It's sudden, chaotic events that can redefine the whole structure of a galaxy. That's a big shift from what we previously thought. But we're not done yet. 
What's even more exciting is how this research sets the stage for future discoveries. We're on the verge of a golden age in black hole observation, thanks to upcoming tech like the Laser Interferometer Space Antenna. It's set to launch in the 2030s and will be able to detect gravitational waves from these massive black hole mergers. Gravitational waves are basically ripples in space-time caused by some of the most violent events in the universe. Like, you guessed it, black hole mergers. Imagine being able to hear the collision of black holes. That's what LISA will help us do. Combine that with what we're already doing with the Event Horizon Telescope, and we're talking about being able to not only detect these mergers, but also actually image them in real time with way more detail than ever before. The EHT recently upgraded its resolution, allowing it to capture sharper images. How sharp? Well, it's like being able to spot a bottle cap on the moon from Earth. Yeah, that's sharp. This higher resolution is a game changer. It means we'll be able to see the structures around black holes with unprecedented clarity. We can study how they suck in matter, how they form those insanely powerful jets that shoot out across the galaxy, and even measure their shapes, spins, and orientations more accurately. It's like switching from watching a grainy VHS tape to 4K Ultra HD, except this is real-life footage of the most mysterious objects in the universe. And here's where it gets even cooler. The research on SGRA suggests that black hole mergers might be happening more often than we previously thought. So, in the near future, with these new tools, we're probably going to catch more of these cosmic events as they happen. We're literally on the edge of unlocking the secrets of black hole evolution in real time filling in the gaps of how these cosmic giants grow from tiny stellar mass black holes into the supermassive ones that dominate galaxy centers. But it's not just about the supermassive ones. Scientists are also closing in on something that's been eluding us for years, intermediate mass black holes. These are the missing link between the smaller black holes formed by collapsing stars and the supermassive ones like Esgar A. Recent discoveries made by observatories like LIGO and Virgo have started to reveal these in-betweeners, and they're helping to complete the puzzle. Oh, and one last thing. Future upgrades to the EHT might even allow us to create full-blown movies of what's happening around black holes. Imagine watching a high-def film of material swirling into the event horizon of a black hole, or jets of energy shooting out at near-light speeds. We're not far from being able to see black holes in action. So, in short, the more we learn about SGRA and its dramatic past, the more we realize how interconnected everything in the universe really is. Black hole mergers, galaxy collisions, gravitational waves, it's all part of this intricate cosmic dance that shapes the universe as we know it. And the best part? We're just getting started. If you've made it this far, congrats. You've just survived a crash course in one of the most fascinating black hole discoveries of our time. And if you're as hyped as I am about the future of space exploration, go ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe for more exciting cosmic revelations and drop a comment below. What do you think about this new black hole merger theory? See you in the next video, Space Explorers. Keep looking up.